billions of years ago, Mars possessed a thicker atmosphere, potentially composed of up to 90% carbon dioxide, which could have trapped sufficient heat for liquid water on its surface. This result in extreme diurnal temperature fluctuations. Daytime heights at the equator can reach 20 degrees Celsius, while frigid nights plummet to minus 140 degrees Celsius. These variations are driven by a delicate balance between solar radiation and radiative cooling. Mars, the red planet, presents a stark landscape sculpted by dramatic temperature extremes. Its thin atmosphere with an average atmospheric pressure of 6 millibars traps negligible heat. Mars's low albedo further exacerbates this thermal contrast. Planet's surface area receives approximately 43% of the solar energy Earth receives due to its greater distance from the Sun. This coupled with thin atmosphere results in a weak greenhouse effect with an estimated radiative forcing. global magnetic field exposes the Martian atmosphere to high-energy solar wind particles, accelerating atmospheric escape. Over time, atmospheric escape due to weak gravity and solar wind erosion gradually thinned the Martian air. Current NASA models suggest that Mars lost approximately 95% of its original atmosphere.
This mechanism involves higher gas molecules like hydrogen escaping Mars's weaker gravitational pull due to their higher average kinetic energy. These extreme temperature fluctuations sculpt the Martian landscape. Sublimation also plays a crucial role, with carbon dioxide ice locked beneath the surface during warmer months transforming directly into vapor when temperatures rise. This process shapes vast canyons like Valles Marineris, which is twice as long as the Grand Canyon on Earth. During frigid nights, carbon dioxide freezes directly from the atmosphere onto the ground, forming seasonal frost patterns that resemble intricate networks of hexagonal crystals. These carbon dioxide frosts are direct consequence of the dynamic interplay between temperature fluctuations and atmospheric composition of Mars. <laughs> 